In Revelation 16 and verse 12, in Revelation 16 and verse 12, the Bible speaks of the kings of the East. The Bible says that the kings of the East, as I come to you today from the embassy of Red China, you see the flag of the People's Republic of China waving above me. I came to you several months ago from this very spot and well over a hundred thousand souls viewed my video. Lives were changed. People were saved. Glory to God for that. And so I've come back to this spot in Washington, D.C. on a beautiful day. The sun shining, not a cloud in the sky. I've come back to this spot where over a hundred thousand viewed to tell you about the kings of the east to tell you the future. The Euphrates River is drying up. And if you read Revelation chapter nine, it says that a 200 million man army is going to come. Now only Red China can field an army like that. And they will come from China in the last days across the dried up river Euphrates and they will come to Israel to the valley of Megiddo, from which we get the word Armageddon. The kings of the east and the kings of the north, Gog and Magog, Russia, Putin will also come. And the armies of the west and the Antichrist and the armies of the south will come and the whole world will converge on Armageddon. And that is World War III. What's going on right now is just the beginning of World War III, but it's going to expand. And World War III is gonna go to the nation of Israel and all the world will come together. And if it was not for the return of Jesus Christ, if it was not for the return of Jesus Christ, the world would destroy itself. The Bible says a third, a third of the world's population will die. Billions are going to die. Friends, forget about a China virus. Forget about bioweapons. Bio we need to worry about Chinese violence. We need to worry about Chinese aggression. I don't know if they're going to take Taiwan. That's not the issue. But I do know they're coming to the Middle East. I do know that the red menace is rising. The red, the red China and the red army of Russia, communism and socialism are on the march in the world. But we must stand for freedom and liberty and justice and stand for Jesus Christ. So from the Chinese embassy, this is Evangelist Mike Dow reminding you, Jesus is still Lord. Amen.